The Bihar government led by Nitish Kumar has come under fire for a 2024 calendar which is for let's say the designated holidays specifically for school and educational institutions. Now the Bihar Education Department schools have quoted uh, this controversy with uh, the list of holidays for the academic year. The Bharatiya Janata Party has jumped in to slam Nitish Kumar saying uh, he should just declare Bihar as an Islamic state with Hindu holidays that have been allegedly chopped off deliberately. They are saying that uh, there are specific Hindu holidays in the calendar that uh, have been that have not been mentioned, that have been erased. These are important Hindu festival holidays, and this is clearly appeasement politics being done by Nitish Kumar. So uh, before we uh, listen into what precisely have the Bharatiya Janata Party said, remember this has uh, surfaced earlier as well and now because we are in the month of uh, ending November, there are new calendars that do emerge for the next year, specifically with regard to what are designated government holidays and what will be holidays specifically for schools and colleges. And uh, according to the Bharatiya Janata Party, with the 2024 calendar that's now going viral on social media, uh, that it appears that there is a list of holidays for the academic year where some Hindu holidays, according to the BJP, have been uh, not mentioned or have been chopped off. Now, the government has not yet given out a statement to say if this calendar that's viral is the official calendar or it is uh, in some way has been morphed or it's uh, incorrect, it's factually incorrect, that's circulating on social media. And which are these Hindu holidays that the BJP says were, while so important and significant, are not mentioned in the calendar. Listen in to hear the BJP stating. Nitish ji, a kaam ki Bihar ko Islamic State declare kar di Assembly se pass karo ye sansad ke pass bhej di chhe. Ki Bihar ka pehla dharm Islam hoga. School calendar ab declare karte hain. Durga puja ki chutti cut kar dete hain. Janmashmi ki chutti rad. मकर सक्रांति जो आपकी पार्टी जेडीयू हर साल मनाती है उसकी छुट्टी रद्द कृष्ण जन्माष्टमी की छुट्टी रद्द और ईद की छुट्टी जो पहले एक दिन मिलती थी उसको तीन दिन बकरीद की छुट्टी जो एक दिन मिलती थी उसको बढ़ा के दो दिन वाह इतना ज्ञान आ रहा है Joining me from Patna is my colleague Aditya Webb who's joining me on the latest Aditya which are the festivals that the BJP says should have been included as designated holiday schools and colleges. It's not been done. And uh, any statement from the Bihar government yet, because the BJP will definitely want to use this, uh, and as they are already using it with the statements, to say that this is appeasement politics. Well, exactly, Pooja. As far as the recent decision of uh, Bihar Education Department to technically issue the list of government holidays for academic year 2024 is concerned of course it has triggered uh, headlines for wrong reasons yet again this is the same education department that has been in news for past several months for different uh, reasons pertaining to different conflicts related to even Raj Bhavan. So this is something that has triggered headlines yet again. And now, Pooja, in the recent turn of events, the, the education department has technically issued a list of 60 holidays, of which 30 are designated as summer vacations, and the rest 30 have been divided in a very different fashion. So you can understand that Kabir Jayanti has been afforded a uh, 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 holiday status, but then Gandhi Jayanti does not figure in, into the list. And, the, and interesting to note here is the fact that in the past years, Nitish-led state governments in Bihar have technically focused on Mahatma Gandhi and tried to re-emphasize his name hmm. uh, and use the name for different majestic infrastructure, be it the majestic auditorium near Gandhi Maidan, Bapu Sabhagar, or Bapu Tower, they are actually using the name, but then they have technically missed on the name when it came to the holiday list. And now the opposition, the BJP is trying to take it majority versus minority and taking the appeasement angle. They are technically saying that festivals like Ram Naomi and Krishna Janmashtami have been technically ignored into the list. And this is the reason behind... <coughs> Uh, due to the appeasement policy of the Mahagadbandan government. So this is what the puja is happening in Bihar. And there is a war of words going on between mm. opposition and Mahagadbandan. We, uh, we would be waiting for uh, an official comment from the Bihar government and the Bihar Education Department too. If what the BJP are making claims are in fact correct or is this uh, just social media 
a viral calendar that's currently on and is this the government's attempt to actually evade Hindu holidays or is there just miscommunication?